Hi, congratulations 2021 graduates of the International Institute of Cosmetology. My name is London Michalski. I live in New York City. I work in Manhattan at Muse Salon currently. I'm a Wella brand educator and master stylist. And I also do session work in a, a photo studio here with a photographer friend of mine. I'm also a competitive hairdresser and I won 2021 Editorial Artist of the Year for the Beauty and Vision Awards that's hosted by Wella Professionals. Um, just a little shameless plug there. So enough about me. Now I want to talk about you and your super amazing accomplishment. So you guys, I just want you to know, you should be very proud of yourselves. You've just completed the first step um, in a long, amazing journey that you guys have ahead of yourselves for a career in hair. Uh, I fell in love with hair and beauty school. I wish, I wish some people like when I graduated would have given me some solid advice though. I feel like I got a little bit of a late start in my career. I'm now in the industry about 13 years. Um, and I did hair behind the chair right after beauty school without assisting for about six years before I moved to New York. And really, that's when I really feel like my career took off. So I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of advice that I wish somebody had given me. All right. So first things first, um, definitely set, a, set like a five year goal for yourself. Where do you want to, where do you see yourself in five years? Um, for me, it was, I knew I wanted to be an educator for a major hair color company. And I also knew that I wanted to eventually be like a platform artist of some sort. I knew that the educator had to come first. And so that was my five year goal. Um, I also knew that I wanted to work in fashion at some point. And so for me, it just took me some time to realize that I needed to relocate to be in a place where I could have more opportunities and to be in a place where um, I would be close to the industry I wanted to work in. So eventually I got it, <laughs> got the, the, the better idea to move to New York and relocate, right? And that's when I started assisting and I, that's when I really feel like that's where my career took off. So, sorry, long story short, where do you see yourself in five years? Is it in your hometown in a salon? That's fantastic. Is it somewhere else? That's also fantastic. Um, but just get yourself there now, physically. And if, if you're, if you're, you want to be in a really great salon and you want to have an amazing mentor, um, do your research, figure out what salon owners inspire you, figure out what artists inspire you, figure out how you can be, be their mentee. You know, whether it's reach out to them on social media, whatever it may be, get to where you need to go, find a mentor, do an assist, an amazing assistant program somewhere and learn everything that you can be a sponge and be humble. Um, the minute you start to think that you've learned everything that there is to learn is the minute you start to die as a hairdresser. So stay humble, get a mentor, relocate if that's what you need to do. Um, the next thing I wanted to let you guys know about, and I just, I really wish, I really wish that I would have gotten, you know, bigger on the social media game sooner. So social media has just become such a huge component of what we do as hairdressers. It is our portfolio. It's our business card. Um, it is how the world sees us. So it's, if you're not somebody who's really social media savvy, I highly recommend taking a social media class. Um, you can also check out at Wella Ed on Instagram or Wella Education on Instagram. Uh, and then they offer some really cool Instagram 101 classes and soon 201. And it's basically teaches you how to use Instagram as a marketing tool, as a beauty professional. Um, there's plenty of, plenty of information and education out there online. So um, definitely get good at social media get an interest in it, learn how to use it to your advantage for sure. Um, lastly, my last piece of advice is invest in your craft. So yes, you just an invest, you made a huge investment in your, in your craft by going to beauty school. Um, you have to continue being a student throughout your entire career as a hairdresser. Um, it is how you grow. It is how you stay on top of trends. It is how you evolve. It is how you hone your craft, right? So make sure you keep taking classes. You take advanced classes. You find um, independent educators. You find companies who have education, who provide education for you. Um, take as many classes as you can. Be a sponge. Learn all that you can. Learn from as many people as you can. 
Um, and stay passionate, guys. Stay focused. And good luck to you. I, I, I really hope that you um, get some great advice here at your graduation today and you really use it to its potential. So again, be so proud of yourselves. I'm super proud of you. Everyone here is proud of you. Congratulations and thanks so much for your time.